I'm Keith Becker from DD's Rentals. Let's talk about what you should be looking for when you're hiring a property manager. You have a condo, you have a 16 unit apartment building, you have a single family residence. Is the type of property that you have a property that is consistent with what the property manager is familiar with? Do they know how to serve the needs of your property? Real critical question. For example, when I say, are they likely to appeal to the type of clients that your property needs? What if you've got a rural property and it's got six acres and it's probably going to appeal to someone who's got horses? Is your property manager likely to, one, do they know how to deal with horse properties and are they likely to appeal to people who have horses? Similarly, even in Santa Rosa, there are enough different neighborhoods, types of properties, that there are property management firms that serve a wide uh, variety of different clientele. Our standards and our requirements are such that we, we do expect um, higher uh, credit scores. We do expect higher proof of income. We do have higher requirements in terms of tenancy and employment. But that is because of the types of properties that we have and the types of tenants that we're appealing to. Um, other companies and other properties may warrant a different, maybe more crunchy tenant. Will your property and your property manager adequately match up with the type of client who is necessarily going to be appropriate for your residence? As I said, you know, many people, the most important question is, you know, what's the fee? There are so many other things that when you think about it as a long-term relationship, the fee is supplemental to the, will this property manager make my life simpler? That's the real, that is the one and only question but there are so many other questions that come into play to make that determination. I'm Keith Becker from DD's Rentals.